Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of On The Road With Jack. So today guys, I wanna take you down to see one of our completed developments in Hounslow, London. Now it's gonna take us just over an hour to get there from our office here in Canary Wharf. So let's get going and take a look. Also, don't forget, if you can like and subscribe this video, that'd be much appreciated. So guys, just got off the Piccadilly line and we're now here at Hounslow Central Station and what a beautiful sunny day we've got for it. Now look, before we take that couple of minutes walk down to see Whitelock, I just wanna answer a question that I frequently get asked and that's why Hounslow is an area. Now, Hounslow as an area is going through just shy of a quarter of a billion pounds worth of transformation. Now, that forms part of Sadiq Khan's regeneration program into various London boroughs. However, before we get to that, Hounslow is an area that is actually really close by to a lot of local attractions and amenities. We have Heathrow Airport, as you can probably hear the planes in the background, Kempton Racecourse, Hampton Court Palace. So it's really close by to a lot of local attractions and that draws people to the area. Now, what that does for you as an investor, well, it not only does it increase rental demand, but that pushes up rental prices. It pushes up property prices as a whole. So as an area, you're gonna see a lot of growth here. But look, follow me, let's take a look at Whitelock and let's get going. So guys, we're here at Whitelock. We've just taken that couple of minutes walk down from Hounslow Central Station. Now for me, this is a brilliant part of the job. This is coming to see the final finished product. I was previously here back in 2020 when we was looking to take on the site and it was a, just a former office building. Didn't look particularly great. We're now standing in the final finished product. Now, the development itself is a really boutique development consisting of only 28 units. Now that's a mixture of studios, one and two bedroom apartments, which we're gonna take a look in in a minute. Now, this particular development was done as a joint venture between both Heartbright and Beemore. Now these guys have completed numerous developments across London, and one thing you're gonna notice is there's a no expense spared finish. These guys complete to a really, really nice high quality standard. Now the development itself has been sold to both investors and owner occupiers. One big advantage that the developer did do is that they advertised for help to buy. Now that's attracted a lot of first time buyers and if you are an investor, it helps you from a rental capability as well. Now, as I said, we're gonna take a look into the apartments now and as I said, you're gonna notice that no expense spared finish. And for me, that is where you're gonna have a real distinction between your apartment and the other developments that are going up around it. But follow me, let's take a look. One thing I forgot to add, security. Security entrance to get in. Follow me guys, let's take a look. Hi guys, so welcome. This is a one bedroom apartment in Whitelock. Um, so look, before we head in to take a look at the sort of living space, I just wanna highlight this uh, nice, um, big, large hallway. Now, the big thing for me and a big bonus to this is the fact that you're not walking um, straight into your living space from your front door. It just separates that living quarters. And again, that's, that's really unusual with apartments uh, now. So I think that's a really nice uh, feature. But look, follow me, let's head in and take a look at the apartment itself. Um, so as you can see, um, you've got a really sort of nice open plan living, um, kitchen uh, sort of dining space. Um, which again is what most people want nowadays. They don't want that sort of separate kitchen um, to, their, to their lounge. They, they want sort of everything on top. Um, one thing I noticed straight away is the oversized windows. Now it's just letting an abundance of light through the apartment itself and it just gives it that area and, and larger feel to it. You've also got, um, obviously in terms of the kitchen, you've got that white gloss finish, nice modern, cleaner looking um, feel to it. You've got to things like NEF appliances. And it's the one big thing that I noticed with this developer, it's those sort of finer touches and those higher quality things that just give it that edge, especially um, when we compare it to a lot of the neighboring developments that are, that are actually being built in Hounslow, because there is a lot that's going up due to that regeneration that I spoke about earlier. Um, one thing I also wanna point out to you guys, the furnishing. So the furnishing is something we've done as a company. So this is a furniture pack we've supplied. And again, things like that make a big difference when it comes to the rental market. If you've got an apartment which has got sort of, let's be honest, a not so comfy sofa, and you compared to one that's nicer sofa, and a good quality of furniture pack, it makes a big difference and you can just charge that premium rent. Um, so in terms of the, uh, the living space and the bedroom, um, some may say it's uh, where the magic happens, or in my case, where you get your beauty sleep. Um, you've got, again, 
a decent size uh, bedroom, fully fitted wardrobes. So you haven't got to worry about space uh, to find things like, yeah, your wardrobe space. And uh, yeah, if you're, uh, yeah, if you're like me, plenty of clothes, it always helps having those fitted wardrobes. Um, but let's head into the, uh, to take a look at the, the, the bathroom finally. Um, so the bathroom itself, again, good size bathroom. You've got a um, double size shower. Um, unfortunately, I'm not, not, not big enough to have to worry about that, but yeah, um, yeah it's, it's nice to have. You've got uh, things like your heated towel rail, your, your big oversized mirror. So it just, again, it's that quality of finish that these, these developers complete to. Um, but yeah, in a nutshell, guys, that's the one bedroom apartment here at Wyla. We're gonna take a look at a studio in a minute to see how it compares, um, but I think you can, we can both agree they've just done this to a really high standard. So guys, we're now in the studio apartment here at White Lock. Now again, you'll instantly uh, see, similar to that one bedroom apartment, that we've got the hallway, um, which again separates that front door to the living space. So let's head down the hallway and let's, uh, let's take a look at the apartment itself. You, we will on the right here as you're heading down, that's where you've got your bathroom. We'll take a look at that in a minute. Um, but then as I said, we head down that, this, this long um, hallway and we enter the, uh, the living space. Now one big thing for me with studios is the layout. That's crucial when it comes to both buying, selling, um, and also when, you, when you're talking to your rental market. The reason being is people wanna feel like they have got separate, separate living space to their kitchen, to their bedroom. And I think this developer's done that really, really well. So as you can see, you've got sort of a nice living space um, here. They've really done well to separate that to the, to the bedroom. But I think this partition here is, is really a crucial part. Now that separates your, your kitchen space to your, to your bedroom. And I said that, that makes a big, big difference. People don't want to feel like they're cooking in the same place as they're sleeping. So the fact that they've done that really, really well and created that partition is really, uh, is really a big bonus for me when it comes to studios. The one thing I also wanna point out is the kitchen, exactly the same as that one bedroom apartment. Now they haven't scrimped and scraped. With it being a studio, you find with certain developers, they'll, the studios won't be up to the same sort of quality as the one beds. But with this developer, it's exactly the same quality throughout. And as I said, I think that makes a big, big highlighting point for me um, that you're getting the same quality of finish. Um, so yeah, as I said, guys, this is the, the living space. If we now head down um, into, the, uh, into the bathroom to take a look at the, the quality there, again, you'll notice very, very similar to that one bedroom apartment. They exactly the same finish, same sort of size. Again, you've still got your, your double size shower, your, your heated towel rails. So, so the finish is exactly the same as what we're seeing in the one bed. Um, so yeah, guys, that's the, that's the studio here at White Lock. As I said, really, really nice quality of finish and developers have not, um, not held back in any which way or form. So I hope you like it, and uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll head outside soon. So that's White Lock. I hope you found it useful, guys, to see what these finished products look like and once they're all done and fully completed. But remember to like and subscribe the video to keep a look out for the next, and I'll see you guys soon. Take care. It's close by to a lot of local attraction and, and amenities. It's close by to Heathrow Airport. Kempton, Hampton Court, Palace, all these areas and places are really close by. Now in terms of, oh, I forgot the next bit, by to a lot of local amenities and attractions. You have things like Heathrow, Air, Heathrow Airport, Hampton Court, oh, Kempt, Hampton Court, or in my case, you get your beauty sleep to look like this. Um, so uh, yeah, as I said, decent size. <coughs> Excuse me. So, so yeah, decent sized bedroom, uh, fully. <coughs> Unusual to have hallways in a lot of apartments. Now, most of them you're sort of walking straight into that kitchen or that bedroom. And um, so it just, oh, bedroom, you don't walk in a bedroom. One thing I sort of immediately notice is these open plan um, or the, the larger oversized windows. That didn't I? Your bedroom or your living space. Again, like and subscribe to the video if you, if you don't mind, and look forward to catching up with you soon. And see us. You know,